It's not about the green. On Twitter, I don't even know who they are, but there is a Wi-Fi Hulk. And whenever in, someone mentions green, there's a little Twitter message about being the Hulk because people say it's green. It's not about the green. I can make any Wi-Fi look green. You just adjust the values. I can make it look purple or blue, whatever I want. Just being green doesn't mean it's good. Green doesn't mean good. Now, an example here, this is from a high school. We went and did a survey in a high school. We put a bunch of APs up. We did a bunch of testing. In a minute, I'm going to tell you about the testing. But let's just look at these two little heat maps. The one on the left is from a MIST 43 AP. By the way, both APs are at the exact same transmit power. The one on the right is a um, Cambium. They're both Wi-Fi 6. The MIST one on the left happens to be a 4x4. The one on the right happens to be an 8x8. Now, if you looked at just the green, now again, these both have the exact same scale and they were collected with data from the exact same survey. And you look at the cambium on the right and go, whoa, that's really bad. Look how, look how quiet it was. Neg 80, all the way out there at 100 meters. By the way, this is on a football field, we, but we stopped at 10 meters, 25 meters, 50 meters, 75 meters, and 100 meters. And then you compare the data. When you look at the data, the missed ones on the left is in green, pretty decent, at 10 meters, doing 120 meg data rate. Yeah, good stuff. Now, this was a combination that where the data came from is a combination of a MacBook, a Lenovo with an AX chipset, a Wi-Fi 6 uh, iPad, and a Wi-Fi 6 iPhone. This is the average data. And you can see the one on the right, the Cambion, outperformed the one that was more green. It's not about the green. It's about what are you actually going to achieve? So strongly, strongly recommend you test what you're doing.